Hi, it's Jolene from Yummy Inspirations and today I have for you a grocery haul. Haven't done one of them in a while. And so today I'm going to share with you my keto low carb staples at the moment that I'm buying most weeks. There's a couple of little uh, different ingredients here, but otherwise they're, these are all ingredients I buy every single week. Um, and if you are new to my channel, I share three new videos every week. I share low carb keto hauls just like this. I share what I eat in a day, keto recipes, meal ideas, inspiration. So if you're not already subscribed, hit that subscribe button and join the Yummy Inspirations community. Love to have you part of the family. So let's get straight into today. I've got, a, I just went to Coles here in Melbourne and did a shop of my keto low carb staples. I've been on the keto diet for a couple of months now and I am in the swing of things and this is what I buy week in, week out. We'll start over here with our big bag of greens. I've got a giant bag of spinach over here, which I will have usually for lunch. I'll have a salad of some description. Um, I left uh, had a video the other day with all of my different lunches that I have. <laughs> the cat is sniffing about. Oh, he wants <laughs> He just always gets in the way. Now he's rubbing me. Okay, so yeah, we've got our greens. We've got some cucumbers there. They're a dollar each at the moment, which is absolute bargain. And we're still in just the end of springtime here. So we've got some beautiful cat's paws. Nope, we've got some beautiful asparagus. They were two for three dollars. So I was quite happy with that um, for breakfast. I've lately been having... Look at you. You want to say hello? <laughs> um, I've been having lately for breakfast asparagus with fried eggs oh, he's just standing on there don't mind me um and lunches we have spinach and i'll have the cucumber also in between salads or for dinner um and avocado as well that's kind of my veg at the moment uh i've been having mushrooms too but i didn't buy it this time that's kind of my staple veggie <laughs> my staple veggies this is so distracting having the cat here oh my goodness i usually lock him up but he's just we've been out all day and he just wants cuddles okay i will give him cuddles um so let's move on so we've got two avocados they were two for five dollars and yeah i just yeah have avos as well awesome healthy fat um and we've got some blue cheese over here i'm going to be Filming a recipe for my blue cheese dressing. It's one of my favorite salad dressings I've been enjoying while I'm on keto low carb. So I'm going to be filming a recipe for that and I'll share it with you super soon. The cat doesn't want to go, sorry. Um, and let's move on aside. Go. Um, so we've got the blue cheese, avo. I've got over here some hazelnut meal. Um, I'm going to have a bit of fun playing with hazelnut meal. I've got a couple of recipes in mind. You'll have to watch the space and see what I do with that. Um, I've got some baby bell cheeses, uh, the two for seven dollars, not really cheap, but um, yeah, my youngest son adores baby bell cheeses and always asks for them, so it's good to have them in the fridge for him, and yeah, I quite enjoy them too. We've got eggs, staple breakfast most days, eggs, <laughs> so yeah, we'll go through a carton regularly. Uh, this was the mayo that I ended up getting. Um, you really got to check your mayo very carefully because some of them I found an organic. I, I used to always use an organic one, and the organic one had something ridiculous like 10 grams of carbs in it and sugars. This one has 0.4, which is probably one of the better ones that I found. 0.4 carbs in it so that makes nice mayo to have and coconut milk i go through 10 after 10 after 10 of coconut milk um i use them in smoothies make hot chocolate all kinds of things to do with coconut milk so i've always got a can of that in the cupboard and cream cheese as well for making fat bonds for roll-ups i just yeah go through heaps and heaps and heaps of cream cheese and my other favorite dairy creams there sour cream thickened cream so many, so many uses for both of them. Yep, strawberries and cream. I if if every single meal there's either a cream or a dairy, beautiful fatty dairy of some description included in my meal. And here we got some ro roast beef. I've never actually bought this. They were cold cuts, cold meat roast beef. Um, I've never really bought these before. I just thought it'd be good to have as a go-to option. Quite a bargain, three dollars seventy-six. Um, I don't imagine it'd be the best quality beef, um, so it's not going to be often. I just thought, yeah, I just thought it'd be interesting to have it in the fridge. Maybe roll it up with some avo inside it, or stick it in a salad to go. That kind of thing. So I got some roast beef and sausages. They were two for ten dollars. So I got two different packs of sausages. The chicken and pasta one. Then they both got different carbs. So yeah, always, always, always check the carbs. Um, this one, if it will decide to focus for me, 
Nope, if it doesn't want to focus. It's got 2.4 grams of carbs um, per sausage. So not really the lowest kind of sausages. And those are kind of more great for the kids and maybe I'll have one of those. And these ones only have one something. What was it? Um, 1.8. Yeah, you can't. It's difficult to focus. Oh, there we go. Hello. 1.8 less than one gram of sugar. So those are kind of the safer low carb keto option of sausages classic beef usually when it's got mushrooms or it's got this nice chicken and parsley there's usually all kinds of fillers and rice flour and uh, other kinds of things to flavor it so the pure you could get the the better but as you saw i'm yeah getting these ones definitely not the best quality but at the moment i just thought we'd get these ones good on um, cheap sausages and lastly we've got some unsweetened almond milk i just buy whatever almond milk oh God, all these rubbish on the table um i get whatever almond milk is on special and this week it was that one so just a box of a carton of unsweetened almond milk because that one is lowering carbs it's got 1.8 grams per cup of carbs and usually in smoothies i might use like half a cup of this or something um as i said my video when I shared my weight loss update the other day. I have been putting together a smoothie ebook which I will share with you in the coming month or so. So I'm working hard on that and so I've been playing around with all different ingredients. And the cat's back. Okay, so that is the and he wants mayonnaise it appears. I need to put all of this in the fridge. Um, that is the grocery haul today of my oh, of my keto staples my low carb keto staples it's just a short and sweet shop this is kind of my go-to ingredients through the week breakfast lunches dinners we have sausage of some description for dinner tonight and um yeah uh that is all of the video today why are you not focusing to me today camera well, did the cat confuse you okay that is the video for today thanks so much for watching this grocery haul if you like the video leave a like and should subscribe subscribe i share three new videos every week and this is the keto haul for today thanks for watching and we'll see you soon bye